How did a small island nation come to dominate vast swathes of the globe? The tale of British imperialism is one that is both fascinating and complex, tracing its roots back to the 16th century and the conquest of Ireland. Picture the year 1569, the island of Britain, a nation emerging from the medieval period, cast their eyes westward to Ireland. The English crown, under the rule of Queen Elizabeth I, sought to assert its dominance over the Irish chieftains, thus marking the beginning of Britain's imperial ambitions. From its conquest of Ireland, Britain's empire expanded rapidly. The 17th and 18th centuries saw the establishment of the First Empire, stretching across the Atlantic to America and the West Indies. The English, emboldened by their success, began to view themselves as the New Romans, tasked with civilizing so-called backward races throughout the world. But, as is often the case with history, change was on the horizon. The year 1783 marked a shift in Britain's imperial focus. Following the Peace of Paris, the Second Empire swung eastward towards Asia and Africa. This shift was not merely geographical but ideological as well. Post-Enlightenment intellectuals began to view themselves as superior to the peoples of the Orient. This imperial ideology, while shifting in response to spatial and situational forces, held steadfast to its core belief in British superiority. This belief justified their conquests and the subsequent imposition of British systems and values onto the conquered peoples. However, as the sun set on the British Empire in the 20th century, it left behind a legacy that is deeply ingrained in the histories of its former colonies. From the English language to legal systems, the influence of British imperialism is still visible in many parts of the world today. In summary, British imperialism began with the conquest of Ireland in the 16th century and expanded to include large parts of the globe. Its ideology, rooted in a belief of British superiority, justified its conquests and the imposition of British systems onto conquered peoples. Despite its fall in the 20th century, the legacy of British imperialism continues to impact the world today. So, the next time you find yourself sipping a cup of tea or debating in English, remember the long and complex history that brought these facets of British culture to your part of the world. The story of British imperialism is not just a tale of conquest, but a narrative of cultural exchange and influence that shaped the world as we know it today.